What's up brothers and sisters? Welcome back to a brand new tutorial. Hopefully you're having an amazing day. Uh, in today's video, I'll be teaching you how to play Face to Face by Juice World. Rest in peace, brother. So this song has a very nice riff guitar and uh, also their whole record is not that complicated. It's only three chords. But before we get started, as usual, if you do enjoy the content on this channel, if you do like the tutorials, please make sure to go down below and smash that subscribe button. As well, don't forget the notification bell so you won't miss any further tutorial. So with that being said, grab your guitar, let's start this tutorial. <coughs> right, so we have a standard tuning on the guitar. And for this record, we are going to need a capo right here on the second fret. So the main chords are D minor. So we have second fret, third string, third fret, second string, and first fret, first string. And we play the D minor from the fourth string all the way down. Next, we have A minor 7. So we have 2nd fret, 4th string. And 1st fret, 2nd string. And we play this chord from the 5th string all the way down. And finally, we have a G major. So we got 3rd fret, 6th string. 2nd fret, 5th string, and 3rd fret, 1st string. Alright, so let's jump right into the riff, which sounds like this. Alright, so let's start with the first position. Middle finger goes into the second fret, third string. Index, first fret, first string. Now keep in mind that we are going to perform a pull off right here in the first string from 1 to 0 with the index. Alright, so keep that in mind. Now let's get back to the initial position. We play strings 4, 3, one pull off, then we play second string, first fret, and finally third string. Again, All right? So, this part we're going to play twice. So notice at the end of the second time, we finish right here in the second string, first fret, and then we block the sound. That's very important. So again. Then we go right into the A minor seven, but we're going to add the pinky finger right here in the third fret, first string. We're going to do a strumming downwards. Then we play 1st string and 2nd string. Again. Let's take it back from the beginning. Then we go to G major. This time we are going to play an open G major. So I'm going to place my ring finger in the 3rd fret 6th string and middle finger in uh, the 2nd fret 5th string. Alright, so I'm going to do a strumming downwards. Then I play 2nd uh, string open, 2nd string 1st fret and 3rd string open. Again. So let's take it back from the beginning. Then we play the whole thing again, but there's going to be some changes in the A minor 7 and the G major. So again. Mm -hmm. 
So as you guys can see, A minor 7, this time we are going to play it without the pinky finger and we are still going to do a strumming downwards but this time we play 2nd string and 2nd string 3rd fret with the pinky finger right here or uh, the ring finger as you like then we go to G major open we still do a strumming downwards then we play 2nd string open and 2nd string 1st fret and that's it again so I'm going to do the whole 2nd time again that's pretty much it as you guys can see nothing too crazy we got one chord progression and two different riffs uh, that we play throughout the whole record all right so that's it for today guys i really hope that this tutorial was very helpful to you and if it was do me a huge favor drop a like down below as well don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already we'll see you in the next tutorial until next time guys stay safe peace